We're at the uh, ferry dock here in Hyannis. We're headed to uh, Nantucket today. Um, this will be interesting. Turnstile, you will need a mask. Coast Guard regulation, okay? So please be prepared for that. I think I got a bar over here. Hey, so after that uh, crazy ferry ride and two hour wait to get a rental car, we're in the Jared Coffin House in downtown Nantucket. Uh, this building uh, is 150 years old, they say, and it kind of looks at very uh, traditional. We'll walk around and take a look at that. We have an immense king size bed. There's probably all kinds of geese and feathers and stuff. They're down. Yeah, they're down. Yeah, we got a desk and a sofa. So it's a sitting room. And we have a uh, chest of drawers and a big TV. And unfortunately, most of the facilities are in a different building. We're in an outbuilding. It's the waterfront here in Nantucket. Getting close to sundown. I'm busy. <laughs> so, uh, this is a small boat here in uh, Nantucket, cute little center console. Yeah, here's another one. Merc 450s and a uh, sun pad. Now, who the hell is going to ride on a sun pad when you're doing 80 knots? This beautiful boat is a Cape Jersey. Jersey Cape. Big uh, flared Carolina bow. Nice tower. Yeah, this will do in a pinch right here. Whaler? Whaler, yes, whaler. Whew. Go out there tomorrow. Look at the tackle on this thing. It's a back, back glasses planet pit. Damn. Uh, quick count looks like about 18 rods. We're gonna try to get out to this light tomorrow, I believe. Nantucket Harbor.
Well, we're in a place called Sea of Sconset, Sconset, the eastern shore of Nantucket. We're going to walk around here. A cute little town and a nice beach. See what they've got for us. This looks like a little roadway to the beach. Here's the beach. Maybe we see a great white today. Nice little breeze. Ocean temp 69. Great white comes out of that much later. <laughs> Long way from Florida here, folks. This is their version of Publix. Far eastern end of Nantucket. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why people get so uh, excited about light lighthouses. They're kind of cool. Everybody's up here taking pictures of them. I'm taking pictures of them. Um, this one kind of reminds me of the uh, lighthouse at Elbow Key there in uh, Abaco, Bahamas. We'll get a little closer and take a look. Pretty good cliff up here. Bad enough they put a fence up. We're in a place called Mattaquette Beach. We're on the west side of Nantucket. Uh, very pretty water, 69 degrees, so we're not going in. But it's very blue, very clean, clear. Maybe we'll get to see the Great White. Looks an awful lot like the beach that they used in Jaws. Well, this is Jetty's Beach. This is a jetty that lines the uh, west, western approach to Nantucket Harbor. Pretty windy over here. We'll take a look. Looks like you can get boats here, although we don't see any kind of a concession. You know, it's fine, especially today on that guy. Stuff. Stuff everywhere. Yeah, there's those balls I really like. What'd you find? This it? That's it. That's it. That's it. Are they going home? Of course. Big ass Boston whaler. Quad three fitties. This waterfront is expensive.
Look at these center consoles. This is a Zealander. I've never heard of it. The Saber. I see a lot of them up here. Yeah, but it was prior. Well, it's, uh, I believe, Tuesday morning. We are in Martha's Vineyard. We spent yesterday traveling. And we're at the Harbor View Inn. Nice little uh, balcony here. We're in uh, Oak Bluffs. There's a little jetty stabilized inlet here. That's a big ferry boat out there. But this thing takes you into a harbor. A lot of ferry traffic between these islands and the Cape. It's like the post. Just filmed around the corner here, like some of it. This guy is trolling for great whites. What's that water like? Cold. Cold? So we are between Oak Bluffs and Edgartown. We're about halfway between. The road goes along that shoreline and cuts out over to where our hotel is. I think that is our room right there. And we are headed. the dinghy dock. It goes out this way. This is the water taxi. These are the high-end dinghies. Lord knows where they go. Yeah. Maybe the 
biggest sport fish I've ever seen. You don't see this very often. You know, I'd go over there and talk to him, but he's very busy. He's just trucking around the park here. <laughs> 